going to attempt to tighten the timing belt on this Honda 91. It's got the 2.2 .2 liter engine. Now, you can do it from outside the engine. What you're going to need is a um, 19 millimeter socket. And turn your left wheel as hard to the left as you can. And if you look in there, you can see big, that big crankshaft bolt right there. And we're going to use that and turn the engine counterclockwise. But first, about up here where I'm pointing, there's a adjuster nut that pokes out of the uh, plastic timing case cover. And you're going to need to loosen that. And I use a 14 millimeter box end wrench, which is presently on the uh, the bolt right now. But you have to loosen that first to so uh, the uh, tension uh, action that we we will be doing will uh, will be can take place. Okay, here we are under the car, and I've got the bolts kind of hidden there behind the pulley. And I've loosened it a couple turns. Okay, that's where it is. It's right up there, just north of that pulley. And now I'm going to turn the engine counterclockwise a little bit. Make sure your ratchet's set up right here. About three uh, camshaft sprocket teeth, they say, which would be just a little bit. What it does, it puts, tightens one side of the timing belt and puts slack in the side that the tensioner will uh, tighten up. So that's enough, just a little bit. Now I'm going to go back in there with my uh, box end and retighten that bolt. So I turn the engine a slight amount counterclockwise with a loose tensioning bolt nut and uh, then I retighten the nut and it uh, should be ready to go. What happens theoretically is when you loosen that nut uh, springs pull on a tensioner inside pull the, uh, the slack pulley up putting more tension on the belt so if all that works, then you should have tightened your timing belt. Otherwise, you've got to take uh, the whole timing case cover off, and there's another balance shaft belt in there. It's a real mess. So uh, hopefully this will work for you. Now, if you hear excessive noise, uh, that's a good, um, from the uh, timing case cover area, that's a good indicator your timing belt is loose. Okay, well, that's it for today. Thank you.